Sometimes cordial, sometimes angry, but always a magnificent hitter. Ted Williams of the Red Sox, a baseball enigma, at times gay, friendly, and affable. At others, grim and sullen, at war with the fans and sports writers. but always at peace with the kids. And content by the side of a fishing stream. Whatever his mood, he was one of the great baseball hitters of all time. One of his big moments came in the 1941 All-Star Game. It was one of the few times he ever showed emotion on the field, when his last ditch ninth inning home run with two on base snatched victory from the National League. Williams fans remembered 1946, too. In that All-Star game in his home Fenway Park in Boston, he hit a home run off Rip Sewell's famed blooper pitch, and they'd said it couldn't be done. 1950 in Comiskey Park, Chicago, was another memorable All-Star game for Ted. He made a good catch of a drive by Ralph Kiner, but broke his elbow against the wall doing it. When he faced Don Newcomb later, he didn't realize his injury. And so, broken elbow and all, he got a base hit that drove in a run. But the break sidelined him most of the rest of the season. Twice, Ted's baseball career was interrupted by military duty. After serving in World War II, he was called back in the Korean action. Who knows what records he might have set. Now Williams was nearing 40, but he was still the mighty batsman of yore, capable of fighting for the American League batting championship against such stalwarts as Mickey Mantle, and winning it too. When his menacing figure appeared in the on-deck circle, it still struck fear into the hearts of opponents. And it was so often the better part of Valor to walk him, he set a record for intentional passes. He played on past the age of 40, but it was ever more laborious now. He was visibly slowing up. But his bat never slowed up. On September 28, 1960, he hit a home run against Baltimore, his 521st in the major leagues. Only Ruth and Fox hit more, and no war interrupted their careers. It was a last long farewell. That night, mighty Ted Williams retired. 